the mysterious death of 350 elephants in the Okavango Delta in Botswana, Africa, between May and June 2020 has baffled the conservationists. The initial suspicions were on poaching and poisoning. However, the carcasses were found intact, suggesting they were not poached. Further investigations have also ruled out poisoning by humans and anthrax, which sometimes hits wildlife in this part of Botswana. Africa's overall elephant population is declining due to poaching. But Botswana? Home to almost a third of continent's elephants has seen numbers grow to 1,30,000 from 80,000 in the late 1990s, owing to well-managed reserves. After months of speculation and concern, the Department of National Parks and Wildlife, Botswana, on 21st September 2020 confirmed the elephants drank water contaminated by cyanobacteria, a toxic bacteria which can occur naturally in standing water and sometimes grow into large blooms known as blue-green algae. Drinking the toxic water would have resulted in paralysis and death mainly by respiratory failure. The research findings were based on numerous tests conducted in laboratories in Zimbabwe, South Africa, the US and Canada. This could also probably be the reason for the deaths of around 20 elephants in neighbouring Zimbabwe last month. Temperatures have been rising in sub-Saharan Africa, with countries in the southern Africa region suffering prolonged droughts in recent years. Scientists warn that climate change may be making these incidents known as toxic blooms more likely because they favour warm water. Scientists feel that natural die-offs will be exacerbated by climate change, with the hotter summer temperatures seen across sub-Saharan Africa acting as a threat amplifier to the elephant herds and other wildlife.